you've been attacked by a credit card washing scheme, what is that? Well, it's when you get all these sort of failed orders come through. And when you look at them, they'll all be generally from the same address. They'll all have Gmail addresses. They'll have random phone numbers. And what people are doing is putting through small orders and washing through credit cards. People often do this with WooCommerce and Stripe. So if you're seeing something like this, what do you do? Well, we've successfully helped our clients by just changing settings within WooCommerce. And what we do is go to the accounts and privacy area. And inside of here, we say customers need to log into an existing account during checkout. We don't allow customers to place orders without an account. We don't allow customers to create an account during checkout. If you leave this on, when people check out, after they've checked out, it says, would you like to create an account? Not before. It allows customers to create an account on the My Account page. You want that on. And when creating an account, automatically generate an account username. And then when creating an account, send the user a link to set their password. What does this do? So now I'm on this site. And what I'm going to do is click up here. And now I've got to sign up. So what will happen is when I fill this out, then an email will be sent to me to set my password with the email address with the registration. And if I go to the My Account page, I'll have the same thing, a register box. This register box, people will have to put their email address in, they can subscribe or not, that's to do with the MailChimp add-on, and then click register, and the email will be sent out to them. And then if you're going through an actual shopping process, so let's just pick any old random product here. So we'll just take this oversized flag. Okay, we're gonna just select something simple there, so we'll add that to cart. And I'm gonna view my cart. And then when I go to the checkout, because I haven't logged in, it says returning customer, click here to log in, or I added this little bit here to create an account, go to the account page. If you want to edit this text, you need to do that with a template, and I'll show you how to do that in a follow-up video. But turning on those settings does stop people washing credit cards. So I hope that WooCommerce tip helps you. If you want more, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, and I hope to see you in the next video.